Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Planet Coaster. It's been a while, but like I've said before, I've been waiting for more content to be added before we take a look back at the game. And as you can plainly tell right now, there is more content. We have a t terrain tools. There, I spelled my name. It didn't work super well. It looks a little funky, but it's still a pretty cool concept. They added all these over here so we can just pull things up. We can push them down. We can flatten the foundation so rides can sit on them. I wonder if I can just chop the bottom off all of this. Oh, wait, no. And now it's just floating miraculously in the air. And it, I kind of ruined it. So now it's like let L. No, that's not L. Whatever that is. R T N P. Ritpa. You know, Ritpa. That's me. That's my name. And you can do different things like flatten to that. You can chisel. You can smooth things out. You can also paint them. So we have this sort of black stuff. Uh, just kind of different rock patterns, some sand, and then just back to the grass. It's pretty cool. I'm liking it. Those are pretty fun. And the main part of this coaster, or planet coaster update, was the coaster. There's so many new and awesome things to take a look at. I'm gonna get a blank map, because this is ugly. There we go, much better. Look at old King Coaster. Ah, it does feel good to be back. Uh, we're gonna take a look at some of the new coaster options. A whole bunch of new different ones. We no longer have to access it using the sort of under construction cheat. Really cool different things. We have hanging coasters. Uh, that one we've seen before. More hanging ones. Oh, those are so cool. I think I'm going to do a hanging coaster. Let's do the boa. Okay. We'll just build it just way out here in the center. Oh, those are really cool looking. And we have complete control over the colors now. So we can change them. We can do the rail color. And then this one is the uh, little support color. And I think this is like the main track color. Yep, there you go. Those are really ugly, ugly colors. Wait, that's like the flat Mexico flag, right? <laughs> Let's change that. We'll probably pick them uh, when the whole whole thing's actually done. It'll be a little bit different. And we have new things, new sort of uh, building organization. That looks normal. Loops, rolls, and just a station. It actually has individual cues for the seats now, so that is pretty cool. And they made this a lot more clear now. It pr seems a lot better to control. Let's go ahead and do a chain lift. Let's lift this up. Build, build, build. Let's just go up relatively high. And there is tunneling now, so we can go underground. So I'm looking forward to checking that out. Let's flatten that off there. And I remember back in the first couple episodes, I was getting frustrated because it wouldn't let me turn the chain lift, and people were like, You can't turn the chain lift! Like, I was getting very angry comments. People cursing at me, saying, You can't effing do that, you're so stupid! And I was like, Well, I know I can because I've done it before. It was a bug. So you see, you can turn your chain tracks. <laughs> I love proving people wrong. It's it's an addiction I have, but you know, I'm dealing with it by uh, not dealing with it. <laughs> Alright, let's go for a dive. Let's see how, how deep, steep we can go. There we go. Okay, let's turn on auto tunneling. So will that allow us to go underground? Yep. Oh, that's so cool. So it actually shows you a little grid pattern, what it's kind of doing to the ground. Oh, that's a really good idea. Okay. Very cool, so it actually completely shows you what's going on down there without having like you, having you go through the ground. I like it. Let's see, how deep can we go? Good god. It just keeps going. It just keeps going! <laughs> okay, I think we reached the bottom there, because the blue part is no longer moving forward. Alright, so let's level it off, and should we just have it shoot straight up? Let's have it do it- can we do a loop underground? I can't tell if it's flat though, from this angle. Okay, let's have it do Norwegian left loop. Well, that sounds pretty cool. Let's go and do that. And then we'll just come up out of the ground. Hopefully, still have enough speed for that. Actually, can we uh, bank it? So let's do some rolls, shall we? Some corkscrews out of there. Is that actually coming up? No, I think it's hitting itself. <laughs> and it's about to come out of the ground. There we go. <laughs> Very cool. Oh, I kind of want to ride it already. I'll try and stop myself from riding it till the very end. Well, I may need to test it to make sure I can actually uh, get out of here with no problem. Let's bring that down. Okay, now it's nice and level. There we go. Okay, let's test that real quick. Can we go over to... So we select it. Let me do initial test. Okay, here it goes. I want to ride it. Yay! Oh, this is so cool. Hanging coaster time. Booyah! Oh, look at that. It's turning on a chain track. <laughs> Isn't that something? Oh, man. <laughs> There's a giant gaping hole in the ground. Here we go! Whee! So dark. Okay, and whatever that was, Norwegian not thing, whatever that was. 
All right, and we're getting out of there with a decent amount of speed. Very cool. Right, let's edit that. And I don't have to build it. I want to edit the track. Stop testing. And test. There you go. And a track. There we go. That's so cool. I wonder if we can actually like put stuff in there. Well, we because we can't really get in there. We could put it like the entrance. Probably just as far as we can see. Let's test that. So if I do like uh, scenery, VFX. Ooh. Oh, right, they added this stuff. Oh, okay, we'll take a look at that later. Nope. So I can't like stick trees in there. Oh, I can kind of reach down there. There's a tree. All right. <laughs> There's now a tree in there. Hmm. Let's let's look at some of this stuff. So we've got uh, bubble special effects. Oh, that's pretty neat. Confetti. Electric grids. Ooh, spooky, scary. More electricity. Explosions. That's pretty cool. Large fire. Medium fire. Medium fire. Ooh! <laughs> Should we just make this like the torturer? We can just burn people as they come in. <laughs> well, this seems safe, right? <laughs> there, uh, this can be like a... I don't know, what would be a good name for this? Like, sh straight to hell or something? <laughs> oh, this is cool. Right, I'm just gonna surround this with fire. There we go, it's looking a little hot. We have more things like just smoke, and then some sparks. That's pretty cool. There's some steam. Water jets, very cool. Oh, that's so awesome. One of my favorite things in Roller Coaster Tycoon, the original one, was like the, the w jumping water you could put over paths. It was really cool. Uh, let's take this, we'll do uh, this stuff. Let's decrease the size a wee bit. There we go. Now we're looking better here. Okay. Yeah, now it's just like a bit straight to hell. Let's actually raise, let's sculpt this a little bit. Let's lower the intensity and... Oh no, we want to go up, don't we? Pull. There we go. So we want to pull this up a little bit. Just kind of make it rounded. <laughs> okay. There we go. Now we're looking good. Okay. Let's uh com continue to work on the track. Okay, so I have it coming out of the ground and doing some wacky stuff over here. I have an idea for what I want to do because it's kind of far away from the coaster. But I might like enclose this in something. But I just want to make sure I can get through that part and I want to test out this fire part. So let's just, uh, write it again. Initialize test. <laughs> I just now noticed that when you actually test it, there's little dummies sitting in it. <laughs> it's like Buster from Mythbusters. And they don't have any arms, so they can't stick them in the air. That's a damn shame. It's the best part about a coaster, right? And here we go, straight to hell. <laughs> oh, God, it burns. It burns. Oh, the lighting effects from outside still show up. Well, that's kind of disappointing, but oh well. Come on, you can get up there. There you go. We go back down. Oh, I didn't even realize I had it sideways. <laughs> I thought I, I thought I was banking it a little too much there. Oh, well, that's an easy fix. Oh, pretzel nut. Okay, still have a ton of speed. <sighs> oh, I completely forgot that that was coming out sideways. Yeah, that was a little bit of a bank. But, you know, it might be cool. We'll leave it. See, as long as it's not too, like, janky, should be good. Let's continue to edit this. Oh, God, I hear the coaster coming. I didn't realize it was still testing. I think I hear it. That might be a bug. Oh, here it comes. Actually, we can see it. It goes up and down and over. And they're kind of sticking out sideways. Then it goes through the double corkscrew. Or the pretzel loop, whatever it's called. Back around. Okay, so it can make it there. Alright, good to know. And then it crashes and everybody dies. <laughs> this is just going to be a complete cluster fudge. And yes, I said cluster fudge. Oh, there we go. We got something going on here. I just had it come down here. But look at this. I love the tangled sort of mess we've got going on here. Very cool. Okay, now I'm going to try and enclose this in a big... Like, it makes basically look like... Make it look like a mountain. Let's see if we can do this. Slowly but surely. Let's go ahead and increase the intensity. Start bringing it up. Maybe if I go like this. Oh, yeah, that's much better. Okay. Let's see if I can get this up. Okay, looking good so far. It's a little bit finicky. I mean, it's basically just like liquefying and morphing everything, so it's having a little trouble with some of these parts. Let's see if we can uh, bring this over. Try and cap it off. And then from there, we can go up. There we go. Okay, now we can start bringing it all together. Fantastic. Okay, just working on filling some of these gaps, and hopefully it stays dark in there. I don't- I- I- I think the- the actual terrain does block light. So it should be like pitch black in there now. 
Okay, maybe this will work better than our first attempt at the, uh... Yeah, let's try and round this off a little bit. When we made Space Mountain on the last map, back in Beef Park. Okay, and the camera will actually let me get in here, so I'm just kind of painting around in here. Uh, will let me do that every time? Cool! Okay, so it does let me in. Oh, it looks like we started to obscure the track a little bit with the rocks. Hopefully not too much. Uh, we'll see when we actually ride it. Okay, we brought this land up. Maybe we should just connect this, make this hole. And nah, I don't like that. Let's just leave them separate. There we go. Okay, that can be nice and black there. And then we gotta add the fire over here. The flamethrower. We gotta unpause the game so we can actually see it. Alright, let's test this out real quick. I added a whole bunch of cool stuff inside of the actual... Uh, the, the mountain area. So hopefully it'll come up pretty cool. I don't know if it'll look very good from first person, but we'll try it out. Let's see how cool it looks. Alright, here we go. Straight into hell we go. Hope we don't burn our little feces, fe feces, feet off. So we, we are dangling. Oh, we can see our feet. Very cool. Okay. Here we go. We're going down. Oh, it's looking a little brighter over here. Oh my god. <laughs> that actually looks pretty cool. Oh god. Sparks and flames everywhere. Oh, it's, it's getting so hot in here. That actually came out really cool looking. Just getting, getting like little glimpses. You can't really tell if you're upside down or right side up. Oh, it's awesome. It's over pretty quickly, but looks pretty sweet in my opinion. And then we're back up to the station. Oh, that's so cool. Here, I'll show you what I did over here. We just kind of went in here and we stuck a bunch of flamethrowers and spark machines in there. Oh, it's so cool. Alright guys, well, that's going to be it. Uh, for this episode, looking back at Planet Coast, we'll probably do two more. Uh, uh, not two more, a couple more. Maybe two, maybe more. Playing around with this new uh, alpha update. But leave a like if you did enjoy and want to see more in the future. I'll see you next time. Bye.